Good morning. My name is Jakub Karpoluk, and I have the honor to present a short analysis of No Theater Costumes at the 2020 Critical Costume Conference. No Theater is a dramatic performance originating in medieval Japan that has survived as a continuous tradition to the present day. Since the second half of the 14th century, No has transformed multiple times resembling the dependence between social dramas and the stage performances. The essential role in this process played a refined costumes. I would like to discuss no costumes agency in two aspects. At first, outfit serves to transform the actor into a specific character, often cross-gender, illustrating social hierarchy, age, occupation, and other features. Secondly, Costumes complete the stage design. It is also worth of mentioning that elaborate costumes constitute the actor's ethos and serves as means of constructing the hierarchical inner structure of no organizations and actors' households. The no is strictly actor-centered tradition and the performance, shte and wacky actors, are the primary visual elements on stage. Their costumes and masks enlarge their presence and convey important information about the character's nature. No costumes seem to be more than mere dresses. They instead form a visual symbolic system. The rich, often silk robes, contrast with the bare wooden stage, creating a sort of harmony of contradictions. All the conventional no stages are constructed according to a specified pattern. This is the National No Theater in Tokyo. All the no stages share the same structure. The main stage is a square. On the left side of the stage, there is a Hashigakari bridge, which actors use to enter and exit the main stage. There is a place for the chorus on the right side and a large image of the pine tree, Oimatsu, the symbol of longevity and good fortune at the back wall. Improvised no stages, sometimes built outside Japan, like the one in the Royal Theatre in Warsaw, to a possible extent, copy the conventional shape. Dozen of outdoor no stages in Japan, like the one at the grounds of the Hakusan Jinja Shinto Shrine in Hiraizumi, also follow the conventional shape. The actions of no dramas, however, take place in all kinds of locations, indoors, in Buddhist temples and Shinto shrines, noble residences and miserable huts, and outdoors, in the fields, forests, mountains, beaches, even at sea. To complete, the, to complete the stage design, actors use costumes carrying decorative motifs, which are able to depict a certain location. Let's see an example. This will be a fragment taken from the classical play Funa Benkei, Benkei Aboard Ship, by Kanzenobu Mitsu performed by the shite actor Hosho Kazufusa and the wacky actor Tonoda Kenkichi. In Funa Benkei, the great medieval warlord Minamoto no Yoshitsune and his retainer, Buddhist warrior monk Benkei, escaping from Yoshitsune's brothers, Yoritomo's anger, while crossing the Dam no Ura Bay, encounter the angry ghost of Taira no Tomomori, who once was their enemy and who died from Yoshitsune's hand. The heroes had to fight for life again, the second part of the play take, takes place at sea, which is signified by a boat-like structure on stage, fune, but also by the shte actor's costume.
let's take a closer look. The main actor who played Tomomori used one of the conventional costumes for this specific role, including the Hangiri wide trousers with a pattern of big waves on it. This motif, this motif has completed the stage design, suggesting that the ghosts of Tomomori aroused from the raging sea. A general term which serves to describe an actor's appearance on stage is idetachi. It refers to the fabric costume, to the omote, a mask, and mochimono, the props. Let's discuss an example. This is the photo of Kansas school shtekata actor Shimizu Kanji playing the role of the ghost of Taira no Kiyotsume, the hero of classic Zeami's play title Kiyotsume. The hero, member of the ruling elite of the country, a nobleman, has committed suicide by jumping from a cliff to the sea after being defeated during the campaign against rival Minamoto clan. The ghost of Kiyotsume then appears to his wife to reconcile with her since they could not bid farewell. Kiyotsune's stage appearance is called Makeshura Idetachi, which means an appearance of a ghost of a warrior who lost the battle. The actor uses a Chujo Omote, a mask of a nobleman. He wears Kurotane, a black wig suitable for the bushy warrior. Then Shiro Hachimaki, a white hairband signifying a warrior prepared to battle, and Nashiuchi Eboshi, a black hat worn under a helmet, bent a right side, which signifies Taira clan. The same hat, but bent left side, would designate a rival Minamoto clan. The actor holds in his left hand Makeshura Oogi, a stage fan called the Lost Battle Fan, with the pattern of the descending sun surrounded by sea waves signifying a sunset and the fall of the Taira clan. Fans are most important props for all no actors. In his right hand, actors, actor hold the Tachi sword. He is wearing an Atsuita robe with the Karahana Bishi motif, a flower in a diamond-like shape, very elegant, suitable for a nobleman, and over it, a green happy, single-layered cloak with the Tessen no Hana, Clematis flower pattern, the symbol of Tessenkai, the actor's ensemble. The outfit is fulfilled with the Hungary trousers with a small waves motif, say Gaiha, signifying the action which takes place at the calm sea, near the shore, as we remember Kiyotsune killed himself by jumping from a cliff to sea. The most important and valuable part of the costume is the mask, Chujo Omote, a physiognomy of a suffering nobleman, mask model on the supposed face of, a, of the poet Ariwara no Narihira, made of cypress wood and pigments. As I have mentioned, shtekata and wakikata actors are separate professions, separately organized, different when it comes to stage functions, and using different types of costumes. Shte almost every time uses a mask, while Waki never uses a mask. Actors never change their occupation uh, during the lifetime. Actually, this high rank robe called Kariginu, literally a hunting robe, could be used by both Shte and Waki actors. It is a long sleeved garment worn by male characters, used for gods and other dignified stately roles, also for elegant refined roles such as aristocrats. This one is decorated with Karahana flower and Cypress fence motifs. Kariginu could be associated with the Daijin Eboshi, a ministerial hat, signifying a very high social status of a hero. Kariginu with the Daijin Eboshi and white Okuchi Bakama trousers forms a Daijin Idetachi, ministerial appearance, suitable, for example, for the role of Tomonari, a Shinto high rank priest from Aso Shrine traveling to Sumiyoshi, played by Waki actor in the Amis drama Takasago. The Shte main actor would use this specific Shoko flower pattern Kariginu for the role of Okina deity in the Okina religious performance. It's worth mentioning that these are the actors who maintain the costume by themselves. 
Suing is actually a part of the actor's craft. During the last few decades, many international and transcultural shinsaku no, newly written no plays, have been realized on stage, including, for example, Nekeya no, based on Odyssey Book 11, stage in Tokyo and um, the ancient theater in Epidaurus in 2015, and the very recent theatrical work titled At Jacob's Well, written by Austrian author Diethard Leopold. The latter was staged in Austria, France, and Poland by Tokyo-based Tesenka no Theater in September 2019. I have taken part in this performance, playing minor Wakitsura role after some 12 years of training. I would like to discuss it now, focusing on costumes and stage design. Two Israelis, an old retired professor and a young Russian immigrant, travel through Israel and Palestine and encounter the Jacob's Well near the city of Nablus. An old, desperate Palestinian woman who lost both daughter and son due to terror and war tells them the story behind the well, the meeting of Jesus and the Samaritan woman and their exchange of water. Obviously, she's the revenant of that woman who desires to meet the friendly man again. In the interlude, a village cat played by three local actors providing text, respectively in German, French, and Polish, recounts the biblical story from its perspective. In the second part of the play, the ghosts appear again as young Samaritan woman, treated friendly by the Israelis. Although the young immigrant was skeptical at the beginning, she overcomes her, her reluctance to accept water from them. As in standard Mugen no, no of illusion drama, the story revolves around a central event of the past, the meeting of the Samaritan woman with Christ at Jacob's well, as related in the New Testament, with him a Jew offering her, a member of the indig indigenous people, water. Let's see a short fragment of the play and interviews with the creators, Shimizu Kanji and Diethard Leopold. Die Erleuchtung ist quasi im Buddhisti in den buddhistischen Wegen die extreme Erfahrung der Ich-Auflösung in selbst. Das No-Theater spielt das sozusagen auf einer menschlichen, vielleicht allzu menschlichen Ebene nach, aber mit einem ähnlichen geistigen Hintergrund. Und dafür habe ich dieses Symbol des Wasser anbieten und Wasser annehmen. Ich weiß nicht, ob man sowas einfach politisch nennen kann. Das Stück dreht sich ja einfach um Menschen, die miteinander Wasser teilen. Das ist ja für Menschen lebenswichtig. Und wenn man versteht, wie wichtig das ist, erkennt man auch, wie man in einer Gesellschaft zusammenleben könnte, wenn man nicht mehr das betont, was uns voneinander trennt. Shimizu Kanji, as the old Palestinian woman, used light brown Ironashi Kitsuke kimono. Conventionally, this color is used for older people. The rope was worn in Nugisage style, according to which removed sleeve signifies a character tormented by madness or grief. The heroine lost her children. The inner layer is Surihaku, a silver foil stenciled short sleeved kimono. The Palestinian woman wears a scarf in the form of hijab, suggesting her Middle Eastern roots. Actor used Parishtina Onnaomote, a newly designed mask, close to the conventional Yase Onna, a machiated old woman mask. As the young Samaritan woman, Shimizu Kanji applied Karaori Nugisage Onna Ironashi Idetachi appearance with the elaborated Karaori kimono suitable for a young, younger character, but of rather low social status, 
Katsura Black Wig and Katsura Obi Hairband, and he danced using a Mai Ogi stage fan. Now the mask. This is the Samaria on Naomote, one of the three masks especially curved for the Ed Jacobs Well performance by Sasaki Mitsuo. Samaria on Naomote relates to conventional Koomote, young woman physiognomy, while garments used on no stages have rather symbolic meaning, the masks are truly mimetic. No is based on contradictions. Now, the waki. Tonodo Kenkichi, playing the role of old Israeli teacher, used a completely new appearance with no counterpart within the standard catalog, but built using traditional costume components. It could be called a traveler or immigrant appearance. He is wearing a subatsugi vest, usually meant for male figures, thin, Kitsuke kimono, and shortened Sue Bakama trousers. Accompanying him, Wakitsure, playing the young immigrant, is dressed the same way, using Kitsuke short sleeve kimono, but his Subatsugi vest carries a tsuru, a white crane motif suitable for a younger character. The colors, colors of Kitsuke kimonos of Waki and Wakitsure are conventionally contrasted. Waki, playing the older character, is wearing the brown garment, conventionally associated with elder heroes, while his companion is wearing light blue and white colored kimono suitable for young heroes. The cat, played by Polish actor Krzysztof Szczepanie, who appeared in the interlude while actually Szczepanie was changing the costume, was using a standard Kyogen farce costume. I believe he's, um, he's eating a, a mouse on this photo. Uh, the most original part of this attire was a Neko Omote, the cat mask, with no counterpart within the existing no mask catalog. Because of their superb textures, colors, and a high number of decorative motifs, no costumes are of a great cultural interest. They are appreciated for their weave, embroidery, and ornaments, which formulate a whole coherent visual code. Thank you very much for your attention.